in Greensboro, chefs from across the community are going to be curating their signature dishes for Folk Affair. So this is an annual event that's celebrating the diversity of food from all over the world, bringing it right here to the triad. So here to tell us more about this is Amy Grossman. She is the president and CEO of the North Carolina Folk Festival, the organizers that are hosting this event. So good morning. How are you doing? Good morning. Thank you so much for having me. We are so happy to have you. So what is the purpose of this event? So Folk Affair is an annual event that we created to celebrate the global cuisines that are available in the triad year round. And um, this is, it's a culinary event. It's also a fundraiser to support the North Carolina Folk Festival that will come later this year. And we hear there are more than 12 restaurants to try. So tell us how will tonight work for participants? Yeah, so one of the one of our goals is to showcase the global cuisines that are available in our area year round. So we've invited I think 13, we're up to 13 now, different restaurateurs and caterers to come and create their signature dishes. We're gonna have Jamaican food, Laotian, food from Senegal, from the Congo, Congo um, Japanese and French and Swiss food. So people will buy their ticket, they come to the event and you can get a tasting of all these foods in one night in one place and take home a little gift, take home a, hopefully a new favorite food so that you can visit their restaurant later in the year. Oh yeah, this wow. is definitely making me hungry already mm. this morning, just looking at all the wonderful types of food and it's an experience for mm -hmm. sure. But Amy, we have to ask you, how does tonight specifically support the NC Folk Festival? So the tickets, there are tickets uh, for tonight's uh, event. And with your purchase, you are able to come enjoy all the foods. Part of the proceeds support the chefs who are gonna be there tonight. And then the rest of it helps us support the festival that we'll put on in Greensboro, downtown Greensboro in September. Wonderful. Can you tell us a little bit more about the September festival as well? How can people find out and, and, and uh, get signed up for it? Are there tickets? Yeah, so the North Carolina Folk Festival, the Folk Festival itself has been happening in Greensboro since 2015. Um, and we're coming back again the weekend of September 8, 9, and 10 to downtown Greensboro. It is a free admission event. We do not sell tickets for people to come to the event. And that's one reason why we host fundraisers like this, to raise the dollars to pay for the artists and the stages and all the things that you see at the festival. So we invite people to come to the festival, ncfolkfestival.com learn about folk affair there you can learn about the festival and ways to get involved wonderful I would never think that an event like that would be free yeah. so that's really cool to hear it's amazing that's fantastic mm -hmm. and tonight's event though is not free this is a fundraiser so tell us about ticket prices and how we can get them to make sure that you can fill the space tonight Sure. So if people go to ncfolkfestival.com, uh, you'll find a link to uh, tickets. Tickets are $100 a piece. And the event starts at 6 o'clock. We're hosting it at the El Elman Bain venue in downtown Greensboro. And when you go to the website, also what we've done this year, we have profiles on each of the chefs. So you can learn a little bit about the people behind the food. And that's also a goal of ours. Uh, again, to inspire people to visit these restaurants and, and these caterers later in the year that's great and mm -hmm. is this like dinner plans would you say Amy or um, you know when yeah. you say tasting I mean mm -hmm. are you really getting a large sampling of all these different kinds of unique genres of food Absolutely. You're going to be okay. tasting, you know, little bites of the signature dishes, but it is a full meal if you're going around to all of them. And if you like one, you can you can go back for seconds oh, or thirds, maybe. Right. Yeah. <laughs> awesome. Amy, we'll be sure to have you back on in September to talk about the yeah. Folk Festival. Mm -hmm. And for everyone at home, Folk Affair kicks off tonight at 6 p.m. in Greensboro, held at Elm and Bain in downtown. Uh, Greensboro. You can still purchase your ticket right now. That website, once again, for you on your screen, ncfolkfestival.com.